Hey. Hey. Ah, I was waiting. I was waiting and waiting and nobody's... Where, where, where have you been? Where have I been? I've been doing detective stuff for you. I mean, you are aware that David's been sniffing around trying to figure out whether or not Liza's kid is his, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, don't, don't worry about that. Crystal said that he's backing off, so... Oh. Well, in that case, then why is he running a, a secret DNA test at a private lab? You okay? Go away. You had an appointment with Dr. Sampson. And you're spying on me. I just want you to know that I think you're very brave. Dr. Sam. I wish I had the guts to go to therapy about all of this. But once I started talking about our son, the pain of losing him, I think I would fall apart. And I don't think I could pull it back together. Look, I'm sorry. I just... I, I think it's great that you found a way to deal with this. David, I, I haven't pulled it back together. Yeah, listen, um, something really strange happened to me yesterday. I ran into Liza and her son, and I, I felt this, this connection to the boy. And it was so intense, it was so real. I, I couldn't understand it. I it get it. I, I felt it, too. Didn't you hear me? Yes. David's running a DNA test. Why aren't you. you freaking out? I don't have any reason to freak out. What, what? are you talking about? Your entire plan is about to get blown to hell. Because David is going to find out that little bundle of joy that Liza's been toting all over town is his kid. All right. Calm down. Just calm don't down. Don't tell me to calm down. Calm Do you know down. what's going to happen when Amanda finds out that you gave away her baby to Liza? I'll tell you what. She's going to leave you. You're going to lose your wife right after we lose that baby to Hayward. Calming it down. I got it all under control, okay? I mean, that, that, that moment of connection with, with Liza's baby, it was, it was so powerful. I, I just couldn't help but wonder if... Look, I'm sorry. I, you, you probably want to go home. No, just... tell me. What? I just couldn't help but wonder if... if Liza's baby is our son. Well, think about it. Think about it. Liza gave birth a short time after you did, right? Well, Jake delivered both babies. Well, maybe Liza knew that her baby would be stillborn, or, I don't know, maybe maybe she wasn't pregnant at all, and, and Jake made a deal with her, you know, offering her our son. That's crazy. You're crazy. I'm, I'm out of here. Finally, what does the DNA say? Why am I... You promised me those DNA results an hour ago. Listen to me. You remember those tests that you botched a few years back that nobody found out about? Well, I promise you they will come to light if you don't get me those damn results within the hour. What? Oh, for crying out loud. Look, just clean this up. The patient slips, you're in for a lawsuit. Why? It was your fault. Excuse me? I said it was your fault. I didn't do it. Just do your damn job. You know what? You're right. It does need to be cleaned up. By you. I quit. Michael Crawford, 340. Michael Crawford, please call Oh, well. Back on janitor duty, just where you belong. It's a good look for you. This doesn't work. <sighs> Your wife ran off crying a little while ago. You just missed her. Really? Yeah. I'm sure it's something you said to her. Harassing her about Liza's baby. Working that delusion that he's yours somehow or another. Mm. Well, I see Crystal's been shooting her mouth off again. Apparently, she left out the part where I said I'm going to back off. I know that baby boy's not mine. Really? Yeah. What finally convinced you? Amanda. She loved our son. If that boy had lived... I don't think she could have given him away, especially not to someone in Pine Valley. No, that would be torture. And her adoring husband wouldn't put her through something like that. Um, I came to see Liza. She's not here. I, I actually have to put the baby down. 
can I can I hold them first? It'll be fine. Sure. for his nap. So that's it, babe. Look, Amanda, I know that David's giving you a hard time. Just call me, okay? Well, we'll talk about it. Just call me. Hey, hey. listen, I need your help with something. That sure. requires breaking a few rules. Oh, well, it's uh, not like we haven't done that a couple of times. Well, what are we cracking David for this time? No, this has nothing to do with David. I need to see the autopsy report on Henry North. Why didn't you return any of my calls? I've been, I've been worried sick about you. I've been calling. You Every can't make time a phone call. I see Liza's baby, I feel this intense connection. My son's not with some nice couple out in the country, is he? You've been letting Hayward get into your head, haven't you? He is desperate for a child. I can't figure it out. He, he can't have yours. He can't have JR's. And now he's fixated on Liza's. But for some reason, he, he's got problems, honey. He's got problems. You're lying. Me. Don't. Do honey. you love me? Of course I love you. Then swear to me on our love that you did not give Liza my baby. <laughs> <laughs> 